there are two types of orders. Orders that are created by companies using Snapdocs and orders that you can manually add to your signing agent account. Both of these types of orders can't be removed from your dashboard once you're either assigned to them or you've added them to your account. However, for orders you've manually added, you have complete control over the order, which gives you more flexibility if you accidentally create an order that you no longer want. For a manually added order that you no longer want, you can either recycle it by turning it into an order for a signing that you do want to keep track of, or you can cancel the order. Here's how. First, locate the order you no longer want on your dashboard and click on it. Here, I'm going to say that I don't want the Lester signing on my dashboard. I'm going to go ahead and click on it. If it's a manually added order, there will be an edit order button in the upper right. If this button doesn't appear, it means that the order was created by a company using Snapdocs and only they can edit the order. For a manually added order though, click on the edit order button to change the details. Then you can update any of the fields. Let's say that this Lester signing is no longer happening, but instead I have another signing that I do want to track. So I'm just going to update some of these fields here. And let's say that my client has changed from first title company to best signing service. My fee is now 90. And the signing is not for Lester, but for Lucy Bell. Then, once you're done making any changes, just be sure to click on the Save Signing button at the bottom to save the new order details. So here I've recycled the order. I've changed the details of the order from a signing that I no longer want to keep track of using my Snapdocs account to a signing that I do want to keep track of. If you don't have another signing that you'd like to repurpose an order for, you can also just simply enter N slash A into the field to let yourself know that this order is no longer relevant. So in this case, if I actually didn't have another signing that I wanted to keep track of and recycle this order for, again, I can just edit this order and we can remove the client, zero out the fee, remove uh, the first name of the consumer. And because for manually added orders, the one thing that is required is the consumer's last name. I'm going to go ahead and put in N slash A for that so that I know that this order is no longer applicable. I can also delete the date and adjust the time. And then I'm done making my changes, so I'm going to go ahead and save that signing. So now this order is just for N slash A, and that is how it'll appear on my dashboard with no client and a TBD appointment date and time and a zero fee. And so I know there that this order for me is no longer relevant. If you'd prefer, you can actually cancel the order instead of recycling the order. So to cancel an order, again, click on the order from your dashboard, then locate the close order button towards the left side of the page. There should be an upside down triangle next to it. Click on the upside down triangle and another option to cancel the order should appear. Select the cancel order option and the order will now be updated to reflect that it has been canceled. And if you go back to your dashboard, you can see that now the status of the order has been updated to say that it is canceled. So there you go. If an order was created by a company using Snapdocs, it can't be removed from your dashboard for compliance reasons. And because the company is the one who can make major adjustments to the order. Because your dashboard is organized based on the signing appointment date though, as you're assigned to new signings, old orders will be automatically pushed down your dashboard, since older signings will appear at the bottom of your dashboard. If an order was created by you though, you have two options. One, recycle the order and fill in the details with either information of a signing you'd like to track or N slash A, or two, cancel the order. And you can certainly do both if you'd like.